let's start crafting and make a teal or ice smile. That's what I like to say. Today's video is part of Sound of Christmas collab. Please check my description box for the playlist. Okay, we're going to try something a little different. I'm not going to do a voiceover. We're going to show you how to make this. And I'm not going to, I'm going to talk while I'm doing it. So it's a four by six frame. I got it from the Dollar Tree. And I love that it was already gold. And I thought it was really pretty for what I'm going to do. So let's see. I'm going to open it now right here and take the backing out. We're just going to put these things aside because we are going to still use it. And we're going to put it right back in there. But first, we're going to remove everything. I don't know. If I can get it out. There we go. I'm still going to leave this in there. I'm just going to flip it. And the reason why I do that is just so it gives that cardboard still a little more. And I'm going to put a backing of a piece of paper back here. Oh, that's Chulo. What? So I'm going to use this music note. I used it in a previous... Uh, and previous project, but I thought it was still so pretty. Problem is, is it's gonna go, it's not gonna fit right on that way. So we're gonna have to put it this way and probably put it a little bit more. So we're gonna cut this part off right there. My goodness, you're gonna hear everything. This is what happens when I don't do voiceovers. Chula wants to meow the whole time. Scraps wants to growl at people walking by. I think he thinks he's Cujo. I always say that because he thinks he is. So we're gonna cut that and we are going to measure it. I'm I always get it go like this. I don't know why, but it's just a habit I have that I get a pencil and I get the eraser part and all I do is just get it and then I'm like, if I'm erasing, and for some reason, it's soft on the paper, but it also gives me that line that I'm looking for, and it doesn't rip it. And that's how I do mine. And then see how it goes? And then I'm just gonna cut right from there. So now I'm just gonna flip it on over, and I'm putting it inside the frame, and I'm gonna put everything back in there. Don't forget, we're gonna put this one first, and we put it on backwards. I'm still gonna put this in there. Just so it has, you know, and then we're going to put the back in. <laughs> Can you guys hear him growling? And he's the tiniest little thing. And here we go. Now we're going to close all that up. So now that that's done. Oh, that, that looks so pretty, doesn't it? Oh, I love it already. Okay, so. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get back to this. Let me get my bling because we're gonna do bling. And yes, my song that I chose was Silver Bells. And I got a bunch of little Silver Bells because I'm not sure which one I'm gonna use yet, but we'll see. So now what I'm gonna do is I got one of these and this is one of those garlands you get from the Dollar Tree. And I just got one and wrap, well, got two of them and I wrapped them all around to make like a wreath, it looks like a wreath, and then you just shape it round, and that's all I did. See that? So now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to glue it right here on the very top of my frame. See that? We're just gonna do that. And I use the black because I do want you guys to see what I'm doing. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add, I decided to do this and I don't know, I really like that it was because it's the silver bell theme. It has a little hook here. So I think I'm just going to glue it right there so when we stand it, it's going to be hanging from our or wreath here, like that. Okay. So we're gonna add a little bit of glue here. 
And now I'm just going to get this little thing here. And I'm going to put it right in there. And I'm going to use my handy dandy makeup silicone brush. I love this thing. Okay. So now we're going to put that there. For my silver bells. Oh, love it. And now, let's see. Should I put this? Oh, you know what? I think this would look really pretty. But no, too much bell. I think I'm going to put some bling up here. So I got this brooch from, um, I don't know. I don't know. Is it kind of too big? Nah. I don't know. I got this brooch from Totally Dazzled, and I absolutely love Totally Dazzled bling. Beautiful, well-made, gorgeous. Never disappoints. Never. And I'm going to put that right there above. Instead of a bow, I want it to be blingy. And now I'm going to get this cute little doily. Oh my gosh, I love these little doilies. And we, I know, we're going to glue it right here. It's simple, but you know what? It's so pretty. And let's see what we got. Let's get it in there. I'm gonna lift it, put it right here. Right underneath. So pretty. I found this little piece and it has this cute little white snowball. I got a little snowball and I'm gonna add some glue to it. And I'm gonna put right here in the center of those bells. I think that's the way it needs. I don't know guys, I think this is done. I don't wanna really put too much to it because I want it simple and I want it to sit so pretty. I think I'm gonna add some glue right here just to make sure that my bells don't go nowhere. Is that not pretty? It has that little doily. I mean, in person, it looks so dainty and gorgeous. I don't know. Tell me, should I add little pearls maybe? You know what? Yeah, why not? I know I'm getting this kind of shabby feel to this, right? I'm like thinking of a shabby feel. It's so pretty. I think I'll put some little bit of pearls around the, the wreath. Okay, guys, I'm out of my black glue. So we're going to use some Gorilla Glue. We're going to use some Gorilla Glue sticks. Never tried Gorilla Glue sticks. First time. Let's see. I'm always using Sure Bonder. But let's see how this goes. Let me know in comments. Do you like Sure Bonder or do you like Gorilla Glue? I'm first time using Gorilla Glue, so wish me luck. Oh, isn't that pretty? I think, yep, that's what we needed. We needed some pearls on this wreath. I needed to bling it out a little bit. I don't know, I think it looks gorgeous. Very pretty, dainty, warm. Oh, I'm loving it. I know I'm a weirdo, can't help it. This is what you get when I'm not doing a voiceover. You're getting me talking your ear off. So pretty. Pretty little pearls. Yeah, I think I can sing sometimes. Not saying I can, never said it. I just think it sometimes. Let's see. That's what it needed. It needed the pearls. Very pretty. Ready? Very pretty. I don't know, to me, a doily just makes it so pretty, right? 
when you see the doily. And there's my silver bells. You can stand it on a stand if you want, or you have this where you can put it hanging on a wall flushed. I think it'll look really pretty if you put like this really, oh, you know, hold on, hold on. So now I'm gonna use this ribbon here. I like that it has gold in it. Um, and it has the green with the gold, red with the gold and the green. So pretty, kind of matches the gold frame colors, antique looking. Uh, so that's why I went with this. You know, when he, they say in the song, I know they say street lights and, you know, flashing green and red and all that, but I don't know, I thought this was really pretty. So let's do this do is I'm going to just add a strip of glue right there. See that right there? I always say see that. Okay, you guys, I have a task. In my comments, what is, I asked you this before, I think. What do you guys say all the time? See that? Look. What do you think I should say? See that? <laughs> see that? <laughs> Let's see. Here we go. So after I glued it shut, because I just really, I really want it for looks. Yeah, we're doing it for looks. And then I'm just going to glue it right here on my frame in the back. There we go. And it's there. Hot, hot, hot. You can still hang it from here on the wall, but when you hang it, it's gonna give that effect that it's hanging from here. We're gonna leave it like that puffy. I don't know why, but I like it. <laughs> I like that. So we're gonna leave it puffy. And when you hang it on the wall, it's going to look like we're hanging it from this point of view. It's gonna look like we're hanging it from this, but actually we're hanging it still from the hanger. Like that. I like it. Yes, I do. Should I put a bow here? Or is it too much? I think it'd be too much because we got all this going on right here. And I want it to be simple, but yet elegant. But does that not look elegant? I'm gonna bring it up to you, ready? What do you think? Isn't that pretty? Pretty bling, pretty. Oh, you can see my ring light, look at that. So pretty, love it. So I hope you enjoyed my silver bells. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I really love for you to be part of my Crafty Lini World family. Yes, I would. And don't forget to click that bell because that bell's going to notify you every time I upload a new video. Join me every Tuesday. I do Lainey Shabby Tuesday. So if you love shabby, beautiful, shabby chic, I hope you'll enjoy Lainey Shabby Tuesday. I post weekly videos. It was my pleasure crafting with you today. Till next time, lovelies. Be kind, be kind yourself and others. Hugs, kisses, and fairy dust wishes. I'll see you in my next video.